Hello, and welcome to a special episode of What's Up Oxford, uh, all about the city of Woodstock. My name is Colleen Collins. I'm the manager of marketing and communications for the city and your guest host for today. Up first is Stephanie Porter. She's the head of education for the Woodstock Art Gallery, and she's here to tell us a little bit more about what's happening in city for Family Day. So welcome, Stephanie. Thanks for joining us today. Hi, Colleen. So Family Day is uh, coming up on Monday, February 19th, and it sounds like there's lots of great activities in store. Now, the Woodstock Art Gallery has long been um, a champion of this uh, uh, event, and so there's always been lots happening. So tell us a little bit about how this event started. Sure. So uh, Family Day actually in the province started in 2008 and a lot of the city facilities were already, you know, participating in this um, day, providing activities. Uh, we didn't until we got to 449, our new location on Dundas Street in 2012. And we had our first Family Day event and we reached out to um, the community and uh, let the youth um, kind of showcase their local talent. And it was a huge success. We didn't know what we were in for, but um, the next year we built from that, um, calling it Creative Family Day. And we started off with a morning movie at Gallery Cinemas. And then uh, the Children's Aid Society um, provided healthy snacks to us. So uh, we've been having ongoing support from them um, every year. So it wasn't a coordinated event and um, Last year, we received, well, we started um, advertising together through the city um, and the What's On Woodstock magazine. And uh, most of the activities were free. Some of them, um, you did have to pay a minimal fee, but the majority were free. And um, it was always my dream to have um, transit provide free transportation to each of the, the facilities um, to provide a more accessibility and an inclusive event. So. Last year, um, Transit was on board providing free shuttle services throughout the day to each of the facilities and um, Creative Family Day became a Woodstock Family, the City of Woodstock Family Day. So um, it's, it's just a, a great event that, um, you know, we get support from the community um, every year. That's great. Yeah. Um, so tell us what will this year's event look like? <laughs> okay, so I did write, I, I'm going to like refer to my notes for this next one because I'm really not sure um, who's providing what when. So at uh, Cowan Park Sportsplex, um, open turf time starts at 9 o'clock and they're having a family day movie at 1 p.m. The museum is offering free activities, crafts, scavenger hunt, and rug hooking demonstrations from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. We are providing an open studio drop-in um, starting at 10 a.m. till noon, and we're having an open house for our new winter uh, 2024 exhibitions at 1 o'clock. And um, Southside Aquatic Center, uh, there'll be lane swim at 11.30 a.m. and public swim at 1.15. And at the Reeves Community Complex, the Woodstock Navy Vets Hockey Game starts at 1.45 um, and free public skating from 3.30 to 4.50 p.m. So once again, a free, trottle, uh, free shuttle service um, courtesy of Woodstock Transit will uh, go throughout the city every half an hour, um, picking, picking up people and taking them to um, all of the activities for That's free. That's great, and I assume that the uh, schedule and the bus route are all on the city of Woodstock's website, That's so correct. people can check uh, recreationwoodstock.ca for that information, as well as um, if you you can find it from the city's main site. So um, there's obviously lots of activities, and people have lots of things that they can choose from. Why would they come out to uh, the City Woodstock Family Day event? Well, first of all, most of the activities are free to enjoy. Um, the majority of people have the day off to spend with their loved ones and their community. And, you know, if you if, if you want to try something new, now is the time to do it. If you're new to the community and you want to see what the city has to offer, it's a, a good opportunity to come out and participate um, free of charge. And, um, you know, we, we try to make it very inclusive and accessible to everyone. 
That's great. So Stephanie, thanks again for coming out and talking to us about what there is um, for families to choose from on Family Day, which again, as a reminder, is happening Monday, February 19th. Uh, again, if you can visit the city's website to find details on all the activities, as well as the free um, Woodstock Transit Shuttle schedule, that's www.cityofwoodstock.ca slash family day. Or again, you can look at that on recreationwoodstock.ca. Stephanie, thanks for coming and uh, we'll be right back.